What is good, YouTube? It's your boy Joe, and we're back with another video. So today I have a little bit of a weird video, as you can see by the title. Um, so just give you a little backstory. Last week, the Lightning Force dropped. Didn't think I was going to get them. I already had put an order in, forced my annual finish line to backdoor them to me. So I already had that here. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to try on sneakers. So I tried and I actually hit. Now this is my first win on sneakers since the actual app dropped. And that's way, like, that's years ago, almost like four years ago, um, This uh, that app dropped. And this is my first win ever, aside from some like preschool ones I got maybe a month ago, two months ago, I think it was Raging Bull preschool ones. Um, I got those. But usually y'all know I do an unboxing, right? Straight from the pack, straight from the, straight from the uh, mailman, do an unboxing. So y'all can see the shoe, get a close look at the shoe. But I was opening these up and something was off. So I want y'all's opinion. I'm gonna give y'all a quick review of the shoe, but I want y'all's opinion. And I wanna know, did Nike send me fakes? So the reason that I think they're fake is this. And y'all know what box this shoe comes in. You've seen it all over the internet. Why do I have this box? Why did they send me this box? And not to mention the box is beat up. The box is trash. It's destroyed. So I'm trying to figure out, look, here's the size tag. Y'all see it, these are, these are the old Jordan boxes. I'm having a hard time believing that they ran out of the new boxes. Really, seriously, like, come on. These are the old Jordan boxes that you get, that you would get back in the day. Not back in the day, back in the day, maybe like, I'm thinking like when I was in college, like 2012 and on to 2016. But everyone knows what box the new fours come in. So I'm like, all right, you know what? Cool, you know, maybe the box is just, different right maybe the box is just different and they ran out of boxes okay whatever so i'm like all right cool you know i gotta hang any black light i've been had this i got this because i ordered some shoes just to see what the quality was like and you know you can tell majority of the time if something is fake with a black light so cool now i'm gonna give you up close on this of the black lighting process but what was crazy to me is, I mean, granted, these are like a new buck slash leather slash type kind of shoe. So, I mean, I'm expecting like some type of tumble in there, some wrinkle, but they're dirty. There's dirt on there, on the back of the shoe. They're creased here, like they've been worn, but the bottom isn't like that. Now, granted, Jordan brand and Nike are not known for their amazing quality anyway. So I'm not like, this isn't a red flag for me. But what is a red flag is the amount of glue stains all over this shoe. And I'll give you guys a close up of the shoe um, under black light. And it is insane how poor quality these are. So for me, the poor quality with the box, this is screaming fake. Now, granted, they look like any other fours that you would get. So, I mean, there are great fakes out there. Like, there are fakes out there that look real. So, I mean, like, one one I wouldn't even know. I mean, I got it from Nike, I'm aware. Of. You know, so it is what it is. But, legitly, now I'll show y'all my sneakers got them. I, will, I screenshot them and everything. I will show y'all on the screen, right here. And I'll show you also what the box should look like, right here. Um, but yeah, man, this is insane to me, dude. Like, so I looked at this one, I saw the was dirt on this one. Let me look at the other one, and this is gonna be a quick video, guys. Like, I'll show you a close up with a black light. Um, and y'all see that, y'all will see that, but like, it's just really insane to me at the quality. Like, there's like dirt on the back of the young man right there. Now this one doesn't have creases like the other, but granted again, the material, 
just could be the material. But this one doesn't have those creases right there on the corner like the other shoe did. So it's just, I, I'm, I'm honestly like kind of disappointed. This is my literally my first win on sneakers ever. And if I got a fake pair, I'm gonna be pissed. They don't, I mean, obviously like, naked eye, you can't tell anything's wrong with these shoes. They look fine, they look there, you know, a good quality shoe to the naked eye. But with the box and then what you just saw on the black light, dude, this is insane. So anyway, I'm gonna do a quick review of this shoe. Um, it, it is a good shoe. So, and it, it is one of those iconic colorways. So I'm, I'm happy that I was able to hit on sneakers and can get this for retail. Um, but as you can see, you do have a new buck upper right there. And that goes all throughout the toe box and the upper of the shoe. And your midsole is gonna be white. And instead of your normal plastic right there, those are also new book, right? So new book leather, whatever, it's the same thing. It's just one side is leather, other side is new book, whatever, right? So material feels great. Material needs feels great. And you have that mesh right there, looks real good. And that mesh is actually um, black, it's not gray. Funny thing about these though, when I first saw these shoes a while ago, like not even this release, like when they first came out a while ago, um, and I first saw these shoes, I always thought this shoe was yellow and navy blue. Always. I mean, even right now, it probably looks like yellow and navy blue on camera, but having a person, you can tell they're actually gray, but every picture that I've seen, even on sneakers, they look yellow and navy blue. Um, so that was just, it's just kind of crazy to me, like now, actually seeing them and I mean obviously it tell, it tell, they tell you that they're gray but seeing them in person you can see that okay they're actually gray and not navy blue just want to throw that out there um you know I was young I don't know why I thought that but anyway um the tongue as you can see a lot of the fours now come with this uh extra padding in there which I like I had a pair of those um white oreo fours when I say had had my dog chewed them so they're in the trash um, but yeah, man, uh, I haven't tried them on yet. I don't know if I'm going to put them on yet. Um, I was going to keep them on ice because, you know, I like the box. I was going to keep them up there. I just got these Stussy Burks and I've been wearing these things nonstop. So I wasn't really planning on wearing any shoes right now because these are comfortable. So I want to wear them. Um, here, I'll show you guys. I got them on right now. Stussy Burks. I wasn't going to do a video, but I want to put them on. So, you know, you get that Stussy right there. That bone colorway. I got my girl pair of caramel colorways, whatever. I'm trying to throw that out there. That's why I'm not, I wasn't really planning on wearing these anytime soon. Um, so yeah, I probably will still keep more ice just put them up. Uh, I don't even know if I can resell these um, for the simple fact that the box is wrong and anyone who look at these and be like, oh, uh, they're probably fake. I don't know. I don't know anybody else who's got in the box, this box. But anyway, um, yeah. Um, the herringbone on the bottom, get your yellow jump man there. And then you do have that plastic jump man there so the ogs the stitching just went around the jump man you had like a little piece of plastic going inside of there but they fixed that so it looks a little a lot better and i'll say a little bit better a lot better you have your flight on the tongue and again it's a gray with the white jump man and then the yellow flight and obviously as you guys know these are like the um cousins of the brother of the thunder so you got thunder and lightning they did come out in a pack but they did release on jump man 23 a while ago um but yeah, I don't have a lightning force. I mean, I have a lightning force. I don't have the thunder force. Maybe I'll pick them up. I'm not sure. I'm really a fan of like the um, OG colorways. I'm gonna try to pick up the white cements. Um, just feel like those. They are expensive though. Um, and then I have the braid fours, which are one of my favorite fours. Or my only fours, so I got those Oreos, but I don't have those anymore. And now I have these. I actually like this colorway. Um, to me, this is like, no, I say it's not an OG colorway, but it's a common colorway. So that's why I like it. Um, but yeah, man, tell me what you guys think about in the comments. Did Nike send me fakes? Please let me know. If you like this video, as always, give us a like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.